Galactic Revenge, Adventures of Olivia Gunn, homebrew game for the Sega Master System. Let's take a look. Year 33XXX in a far galaxy. Far and distant galaxy, I think it said. Dirty, far and dirty galaxy is what it said. Okay, let's look at the storyline a little bit. You cannot escape and will suffer my anger. You do not have nothing to do, human. First, you emptied my refrigerator. <clears throat> then you killed my boyfriend. Jeez. Going from like something like emptying a refrigerator right to killing a boyfriend. That's pretty horrible. You s and you stole my love master system. You guessed it. That was the plan. Ooh -hoo -hoo. This is the funniest machine ever done. I will recover it, I promise. At all costs to get that Sega Master System back, she will kill for it. <sighs> oh my alien god, we have a breach. Now I will enter, prepare to die. Let's go. Get into the game. There's that one robot. Okay, wait for my chance to jump. Uh, heart. Shoot. I just about bit the dust there. Right now I got a boss to fight. My suit is heavy to jump with gravity. It's too heavy to jump with gravity. Hmm. I need lighter clothes to continue. Okay. So obviously bad uh, sentence structure here, but whatever. Fun game. Oh good, I forgot to bring spare. Oh, oh good, I forgot to bring spare clothes. So I think that she's saying it's a good thing. Luckily I have my deadly shurikens. Maybe she was trying to say, oh god, I forgot to bring spare clothes. Okay, so level two, shurikens this time to use, awesome. I'll tell you, I really like this game, and I really like Pigaris, A Flight of Pigaris, which I played earlier and made a YouTube video of. So that's two, this is two really, 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 really good Sega Master System homebrews. These could have easily come out in the 80s for the Sega, and they would have been, I think, both well-received games. I really do. This one reminds me of like the maze part of it, like the way the levels are designed reminds me of a um, Alien, uh, not Alien, Alien Syndrome, that's the one I'm thinking of. Now I'm gonna face off against level two boss. Oh shoot, 
Thank God I got a heart back. Just about ready to face off against level 2 boss. Okay, some gold. Robots. Okay, this is this is going to be the troubled area here. Oh shoot! Come on. Oh, he's all over me. Okay, I did it, I did it, I did it. Oh, how can I get that heart without dying? Yes, I did. Oh, this is going to be a toughie here. Okay. Uh oh. Oh, jeez, I didn't mean to fall. Oh, my God. Oh, well, there you go. I met my fate. Now, I can continue, but I think this is a good time to uh, just talk about this game. Pretty good game, right? Pretty good game, and it's a homebrew. Like I said, it would have been a successful game if it came out in the 80s for the Sega. Definitely. Lots of fun. You get a chance to acquire this game, you know, you won't be disappointed. So, I got you through two levels. I may play this again on YouTube, but uh, I'm going to move on to other things now. But uh, this was fun. All right, I'm out, I'm out.